So I'm down at the uh, bird sanctuary in Comox, BC with my uh, Columbia Rambler from Walmart. And I've made a few upgrades since my last video. Comox Bike Company in Comox, BC were nice enough to give me uh, some Avid uh, cable brakes. These are these are pretty old school, but uh, they work a lot better than than what came on this bike. They just bolted right on. I used the uh, hardware from from the spike, so it was it was a pretty easy pretty easy swap over. Um, and I put on some Kona locking grips. So this bike's starting to feel a little bit better. So the next upgrade I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go buy a new seat for it. The seat is uh, it's starting to well, I just want to get a new seat for it, okay? There's one thing I should uh, let you know about this bike. Uh, if you're thinking about getting into mountain biking, you know, you've never never ridden mountain bikes, you're like thinking, hey, I want to get into mountain biking, um, this isn't the bike for you. This this bike, you, 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 will, you won't have a good time. It's it's not confidence-inspiring. Let's let's just call it that. The, the geometry's all wrong. Um... There's no suspension, there's no gears, the, the gearing isn't very good. Um, with my transition clunker, it's a single speed and I can get up most hills and it's 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 a hard bike to pedal and this this one, I, I don't know what it is about it. It's, it's, uh, you know, I think it's the short crank arms. If that was my guess, I, I would blame it on the crank arms. They have a very short crank arm. So, yeah. So if you're thinking about getting into mountain biking, um, don't buy this bike. Uh, this, is, this is something that you're going to buy if, you know. You want to putter around, maybe, or do what I'm doing, which, you know, maybe you'll do that. I don't know. Anyway. So, uh, yeah, hope you like this video. Um, have a nice day.